recording and rolling up and down the fingers. And into the palm. And the pad of the pinky. And then the thumb. We're going down to the wrists. And up to the knuckles and across. And keep the ball in the palms, interlace the fingers, and squeeze. And release. And squeeze. And release. And squeeze. Let's go around the back. Switch. 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 Hinging at the waist, we're going through the legs. Switch. The spine's nice and neutral. Head up. Switch. And put the ball on the floor. It says how the feet feel. And step on the ball, pressing down in the middle of the foot three times. Go up to the knuckles, press on each, going across. Roll across the knuckles. Bring the ball to the middle of the foot and wiggle the toes. Press the toes into the ball. Raise the toes and separate. Press the toes again. Wiggle again, in the middle of the foot. And scribble. Three, two, one, release, reassess, repeat, middle of the foot. Knuckles. Roll across. Middle of the foot, wiggle the toes. Press the toes into the ball. Raise them separate. Press again. Wiggle again. Dribble. Three, two, one. Get the ball out of the way. Reassess how the feet feel, the ankles, the knees, the hips. And then let's do some wood chives. Hinging at the waist, straight up and down. Do about seven of those. And then we're going to go diagonally from one side to the other. And then we're going to go to Agley from the other side. And 
and then they shake the tree. Two, one, center. Twisted the waist, swing the arms. And center. With some motion wave breathing. Fingers and thumb at the base of the spine. Step to the side, gather and start. Throw it out in heart, throat, good eye. Two times around the clown. And back down, good eye, throat. Heart, lower down for it. Same thing, other way. And the center. Let's take steps forward. And then elbow towards the opposite knee. And then slap the opposite here. And slap it behind you. And take a cross step with a twist and a punch. And then walk. Four marks. Or job. Today, we're going to do our seated exercises. We are going to do 10 sit to stands in the chair, but uh, not anything uh, I think would necessarily preclude you doing rapid squats if you want to do those. You can do what you're doing. Whatever you do, be safe. I am going to sprint myself. I'm going to do yin yoga in the rest of the class. We didn't uh, do anything yesterday, so I don't want to miss the yin yoga. I'm going to do the sprint in five, four, three, 
to one. And one and thirty. Press. And to lace those fingers or raise the hands up. Come up on your toes if you can. And come on back down, bend back if you can. Back to center. Drop one hand, bend in that direction. Go the other way. Come back to center, interlace the fingers at the top of the head. Bring the hands down to the chest and push up. Yeah, come on down and interlace the fingers behind the back. Raise the hands up, squeeze the shoulder blades together. And go a little higher. Come on down, shrug. Roll the shoulders back. And forward. Then the arms rotate. And go the other way. One palm up, one palm down, flip flop. Bring one arm across the body, press in at or, or, or above the other. And the other. First down behind the back, press down and in. And then the other. Grab both elbows, rock side to side. And extend one arm, fingers up, pull back. Fingers down. Flop the wrist. Keep flopping. And rotate in one direction. And then the other. Other hand, fingers up, arms extended, fingers down, drop the wrist, rotate, go the other way. Come on down, form an L. 
Squeeze the shoulder blades together and hold. And release. Squeeze. Release. And squeeze. Release. Rotate the neck. Go the other way. Nod. And go either shoulder. Look up. Look down. Over one shoulder. And then the other. Look in the chin. Like a pigeon. Three, two, one. Uh, let's go up the floor. I'm going to put that pole inside the arch of one foot. The other foot is out to the side. He is bent. So lie down the pole, stretch the hamstring. Inner thigh, really. And the hamstring. And go the other way. Come on up. Pick out in front of one foot. Those are about six inches away. Put the top of the stick on the collarbone. Slide down. You lift the sole. Wiggle it. Wiggle the sole. Put it on the heel. Come on up. Press the sole against. Mistake. And then we'll repeat on the other leg, starting with the hamstring stretch. Riding down, lifting the sole of the foot. Wagging it back and forth if you can. Three. One, come on up. Press the sole of that foot against the stick. And come on up. We're going to do the EFI turning bar. So put the stick parallel to your spine. One hand on top, one on below, and move it up and down. Reverse positions of the hands, do the same thing. And then bring the stick up overhead and go side to side. And then bring the stick to your shoulders, palms facing in, do 10 bicep curls. Mm 
reverse the grip. Hinge at the waist, bend your knees slightly, let the stick come down. Spine is neutral, head is back, lift the stick, go back down. 10 times. It's fine, nice and neutral in the head back. All the work is in the hamstrings and glutes. And then keep the stick down there, and then slightly bend. Reaching at the waist, and lift the elbows past the rib cage. Come on up, stick is at the shoulders, lift it up overhead and back down to the shoulders. And then drop it below the waist and we'll lift the elbows up to shoulder height. Keep it at the shoulders, push out. Bring it around back. Palms are facing away from the body. Keep the stick behind you 10 times. Reverse the grip and do it again 10 times. Stick in the crook of the elbows, twist it, boys. And then bring it around front. Hold on with two hands or one hand or a finger with two, step back. Feet are about hip width apart, maybe a little bit uh, wider. Dig your toes into the ground, roll back onto the fifth metatarsal, creating a big arch, and hold. Then roll towards the first metatarsal, back to the fifth, back and forth. Not me. And splayed, not knee splayed. Keep those toes dug into the ground. Three, two, and one. All right, let's put the stick down, grab a chair. You can start with some sit to stands. If you want to put something in your hands, feel free. I'm just going to do it moving my hands around. If you can do that, fine. Otherwise, you can put them on the side of the chair and help yourself up. It's one, two, three, four. Eight, nine, and ten. Sit down. You're in the middle of the chair. Hands are parallel to the ears. Lean forward about 45 degrees and come back. Core is engaged. Navel is 
back towards the spine. One more. Brush your hands and chest. Still in the middle of the chair. This time, lean back, touch the back of the chair. Or it's engaged. Bring one leg over the other. Ankle is right above the knee. Rotate the ankle in one direction. Go the other way. Point the toes towards and away from the shin. Hinge forward at the waist, press down on the knee of the leg that's crossed. And come on back up. Put that leg on the floor. Bring the other leg across. And rotate the ankle. Go the other way. Point towards and away from the shin. Press on the knee, lean into it. Come on up, bring that knee to the floor. Separate your legs, come across the body towards the toes. Don't have to touch them. Get back and forth. And lean at the waist. Come on back up. Put one hand on top of the other palm, grab your fingers and pull apart. Reverse the position of the hands, going the other way. Prayer position, push together. Hands behind the back, twist from one side to the other. And finally, we're going to end with some seated jacks. Very good. All right. I'm going to get up with the chair out of the way. Doing four, seven, eight breathing. Again, if um, I'm going too fast for you or too slow, adjust it to your own uh, uh, comfort. Diaphragmatic breath in through the nose, to the belly, through the chest for four, hold for seven, exhale through the mouth for eight. I'm going to do five times.
народу всем всегда. And the center. Two breaths. And pause on the inhale, let's uh, send it out. Enter your best. Bring down heavenly chief. Go down, gather it up. And oh, ha ha. I'm scared. All right, we're going to do some five Tibetans. And we're going to open the musician there. And no, I'm doing a yin yoga, I'm sorry. Um, timer. Today's quotation Optimism is the faith that leads to achievement. Nothing can be done without hope and confidence. Helen Keller. Timer. Sound on. Up. Start. Go to the floor. Fix the camera. All right. We're going to start in cat position.
transfer
needs to check. Thanks, Tom. You're welcome, Jonathan. Have a great day. As I was watching that movie, I, I at one point I thought, "Is this your story?" <laughs> <laughs>